What's good, y'all? It's Cliff Mega. And just jumping right up into it. This video is about the GMOs is changing how a woman look, how they really supposed to look. So I remember when before my wife, we really we just started, you know, with the health stuff. I don't know, I think maybe 2007 or something, 2008, and you know, my wife was thick, everything, the big hips and all that, but even when I first met her, she always had hips and all that, because my wife is a dancer, she had the bunk, all that, so, you know, after the kids, she got thicker, still everything was good, now when she got the, the love handles, whatever, no, I, I mean, I call it the fat back. Spanish brothers call it chicho. <laughs> anyway, she wasn't feeling that, so she was like, I got to get rid of this and all that. So just, you know, noticing um, as we start progressing with this, um, this organic lifestyle, and as soon as we really started stop eating corn, our weight just left. I mean, we, it's like we just, like I said, we thought it away. So I look at my wife now, and I'm like, wow, like, I'm like, yo, she's really beautiful. And not just because she's slim, it's because of what she eats. And I'm like, if, you know, we end up having a baby again later, I don't have to worry about nothing because my wife eats good. So basically what I'm trying to say is, if you're eating the right food, and, you know, if y'all watch a couple of our videos and stuff, and I mentioned that the majority of the food in the U.S. has soy, corn, and dairy, um, if you stay away from those, you're not going to look like how you look right now. If you eat those three things, you're exactly like how you look. Which, in, I don't know, this is to whoever that runs into to come across this video and stuff. If you're happy with how you look, then hey, you know what I'm saying? It's not trying to, like, I'm not trying to get at you or anything. But I'm just telling you, when you really seek this organic lifestyle, and I'm talking about eating real food. There's not really, there's no weight that's going to be on you. Me and my wife is like, we're living proof of that. Because we both, I've had size on me. But not like fat. I've always been, I had like muscle, i always been muscular because that runs in my genes. Um, my wife, like I said, she's always too, she's been slim. But she just got thicker and thicker after, you know, the years with our children and all that. And, you know, I like it. But now, you know, when she always be like, oh, I wonder if you be checking out those girls and stuff. I tell her, I'm like, yo, I look, but I never, you know, I'm not touching, like, I ain't trying to mess up what we got, and I always be like, if this female is eating like how we eat, she's not even going to look like that, because if you're eating a real, you're living a real vegan lifestyle, you're not going to have that much weight, and you're not going to be hungry all the time, like, I eat, I eat like maybe every, um, nine ten hours like I could go long periods of time like I said I do this this is this is a lifestyle for me now I don't do this because I'm like oh let me try to discipline myself to do it. like this is a lifestyle for me now and like I said my wife like we can't even eat that much so when you're eating real food you're not gonna want to be eating all the time like how all these foods are these processed GMO food I just want to give you all something to think about because um it's changing our DNA and then we're getting all that comes with it, all this, all this cancer, diabetes, all this stuff. Our conscious movement is trying to change our DNA, and it's giving us all types of problems. So just trying to give y'all something to think about, you know, um, really, like, jump into this health stuff, man, because a lot of us is dying early, and if we ain't dying early, we're dying slow of pain, not even be able to enjoy life like that, so... Really, if you can, stay away from those three GMO foods. And if you have to eat them, eat them organic. It's better. Or non-GMO. Like I said, soy, milk, and corn. Those, those are the three right there. Those are in everything that you eat. It's in 90% of all the food that you eat. So if you can stay away from that, and it's going to be hard, try to at least just cut down on it. Because like I said... You probably eat 10 to 20 things, and all those things are having in it. So just if you eat 20 things, just cut down to maybe like seven or eight things of it and stuff. Every little thing that you do to, you know, try to improve your life, it helps. Anyway, this is Cliff Mega. Um, comment. Um, peace, and, peace and blessings to you.
later, y'all.